Also now at 11, hungry for crime. A man caught on camera tossing a Molotov cocktail toward a South Florida restaurant. It's the second attack in two months. The first flamed out at the back door. The second nearly hit a grease trap. Now people working there have fears over what could happen next. CBS News Miami's Larry Seward is on Hollywood Beach where police are asking for help. It's seared concrete. Oh, everybody's on edge. Cut owner Massimo Gramazzini deep and stuffed staff inside Hollywood's Broadwalk restaurant with worries simmering over flaming Molotov cocktails tossed at their livelihoods twice in recent weeks. I have no clue. I have no clue what could happen. It's crazy. It's blindsiding because you, uh, you, you know, you try to run your business every day and then all of a sudden somebody comes and, and does something like this that can just take everything away in a heartbeat. Early Tuesday morning, cameras caught this red car parking behind the restaurant. Next, flames erupt on the pavement. When it burned out, staff found pieces of a beer bottle and Molotov cocktail, similar to what investigators found here in June. I had no clue who could be. Surveillance video shows a similar car parked in the same spot around the same time of morning with what staff says is a similar looking man throwing flames at the restaurant's back door. Crime Stoppers put up this $5,000 reward to help police catch the guy without luck. And they called in the feds and ATF came. Staff saw federal investigators collect evidence and leave with several leads, but until there's an arrest, the unknown keeps Gramazzini up at night. My biggest fear is, is this person trying again and being successful. The owners here say they have no enemies, no problems with former employees or neighbors, and they worry that if the suspect is not caught soon, someone else could be the next victim. On Hollywood Beach, Larry Seward, CBS News, Miami.